This is Jen Browning in Tech Service with BASF. And today I just want to give you a five minute overview of Velifer Fungal Contact Insecticide and Miticide. This is a BASF proprietary strain of Bavaria bassiana, and it's a direct contact insecticide miticide. What you can do with Velifer is manage insects and mites in the greenhouse. So that's aphids, mealybugs, two spotted spider mites, thrips, and whiteflies. Let's take a look at the Velifer product profile. Velifer has a flexible rate range of 3 to 13 fluid ounces per 100 gallons of water. And I know you're wondering if you can put it out in a fogger. And yes, you can. So you'll just want to choose a fogger that has cool temperature ranges so those don't compromise the spore survivability. The spray interval is dependent on your pest pressure and your thresholds. And what we recommend is that you put it out every seven days as a foundational application. Most growers who have successful Velifer programs put it out every seven days. The label will allow you to go out as frequently as every three days, but most of the time you won't need to do that. The PHI is zero days, and the crops that are on the label include ornamentals, fruits, vegetables, herbs, and spices, and transplants that include those for the home consumer market, as well as those for agriculture. I wanna show you what the formulation looks like. So over here on the far left is a water control, and then you have Velifer at 13 fluid ounces, which is the top of the rate range. You have a saturated solution of 21 fluid ounces and a super saturated solution of 42 fluid ounces. Over on the right, you have the next best product on the market. And what you can see is that Velifer mixes well into solution. It's nice and clear, and that's what gives it its good behavior in the spray tank, as well as makes it behave on the plant. And I'll show you what that looks like in just a moment. One of the things that we're very proud of is that we move Velifer through the supply chain with our cold tunnel logistics. So what this means is that when a grower places an order for Velifer, it comes to them from our production facility and it's cold the entire time. So when it arrives, it's been kept cold and it has an expiration date on it. If the grower can keep the product cold, then it has a shelf life of 24 months. And if they can't keep it cold, then it has a shelf life of 12 months. So they can keep it protected from extreme heat or UV and protect it also from freezing. And then they'll know exactly how long that product is good, exactly how long the spores will survive. And that's useful so that you don't waste your time putting out a product that isn't alive anymore. We have information available about compatibility with BCAs. We followed IOBC protocols to know what Velifer was compatible with. That said, we recommend that you release BCAs after you make applications of Velifer, so allow sprays to dry, potentially make your applications of BCAs on the following day. We also have data available about tank mix compatibility with Velifer, so you just ask your sales rep for those data. We also have data available about efficacy, and what you see here is the data summaries for aphids, for thrips, for whitefly, and for two-spotted spider mite. What you'll see that all of these data sets have in common, they're all global, they're indoor, they're outdoor. What they have in common is that efficacy is really tied to starting population. So as with all biologicals, Velifer does the best job when you start at low or low to moderate populations. Once you're in the summer months and you have high pest populations, that's gonna be hard for any biological to keep up with. So we recommend that growers start when their populations are low or low to moderate and adopt that seven days, every seven days foundational application strategy to keep populations low and allow it to do the best job possible. I wanted to show you what Velifer looks like when it's made applications to plants that are in flower and also so you can see what it looks like on the leaf surface. So this is an application that's made to impatiens in bloom. This is over the labeled rate, so you really get a sense of what it looks like on the leaf surface and how it impacts flowers. On impatiens, 21 ounces and 100 gallons. This is one day after treatment. You can see that the flowers look fine. You don't see any residue on the leaf surface. And we have seen good plant safety in blooms and also on flowers across a wide variety of plants that we've tested. So in summary, some key features and benefits about Velifer. This is an effective and easy way to add to a biologicals program and an integrated pest management program. It's also a simple way to enter the biological control space for growers who haven't used a biological before. 
Bavaria bassiana is parasitic on a wide variety of insect pests, so that makes it simple as well. You get rapid feeding cessation and death in about 24 to 48 hours. One of the things some people don't know about Bavarias is that they're actually a knockdown organism, and that makes them an easy BCA to use. Velifer works with chemical controls to manage pest populations and almost acts like a pool skimmer on the pest populations and keep the, keeps them low and manageable so that other BCAs can work and so they don't have to use chemical control rescues as frequently if they don't want to. Excellent resistance management tool. It's not very easy for insects to develop a way to resist what Bavaria bassiana does when it parasitizes pest insects and mites. Compatible with beneficials and non-target arthropods. You've seen that enhanced plant safety profile and that low to no plant residue as well as that good behavior in solution. And we're very proud of that cold tunnel transport and that ability to deliver viable spores right to the grower's doorstep. If you have any questions, please reach out to your BASF sales rep. Thanks for watching today.